Hey, it's Zipaki Yoxy. Uh, last time we left off, we were gonna do this boss battle, which I never really got to uploading. But that doesn't matter. I'm out of school, have more time, and now you should see updates more frequently. If you seen my update video yesterday, you'll notice that I said I'd upload, which is true. I also started working on the file. So I'm only about maybe five minutes into the game. Yeah, because my micro SD card went somewhere, I don't know where it is. And I'd use the one for my phone. I have to keep switching the files back and forth, back and forth. So, yeah, I don't have much time. Um, anyways, this boss battle is pretty simple. You just have to hit like, that ball of energy, I'm not sure what you would call it. Back at them, and, uh, yeah. Don't get hurt. Uh, there's also a glitch in this battle, which is demonstrated by complete accident. Not what's on it. Nah, I'll point it out when we get to it. Um, so, for six months, I also said this in my update video, you won't be seeing any videos longer than 15 minutes. And 30 seconds. I got a flag, or strike, if you want to call it, from Warner, Brod Warner Brothers, yeah, which one, easier, and yeah. with that new crappy Looney Tunes show, they took off one of my videos, gave me a strike, and completely fucked me up. So yeah, but it shouldn't be much problem with this walkthrough, because I don't really go over 15 minutes that often. I've done it a few times, but most of the times, no, not really. And I've gone over by a few seconds, but yeah, it won't be much of a problem. Here's the glitch. I'll keep doing that back and forth. If they're close enough, they'll always do this. It doesn't matter how many times you throw it back at them, they'll never get hurt. So at this point, once you realize that the glitch is occurring, just get hurt or It also happen when there's four or three in this. I've only seen it done with two because it occurs more often. But, uh, yeah, this Ow. Oh, really hurts now. Um, so what have you guys been doing? I graduated eighth grade even though you don't get in. stupid. Basically, no point in going to that. And, uh, I'll do it. My official belief hurts so much. Okay, just. Okay, I found out why my back was hurting so much. Apparently, when I was scratching my back, I hit. Scratched my pen more. Popped it. Or ripped it off, whatever you want to call it. So. more sense if we're going against the green one instead of the yellow one because the green one's the last one. Oh well it doesn't matter, they're all the same. Okay, not, but you know what I mean. So with my four day time limit counting today, that's how long I have to get back where I was. I won't be doing Fire Temple on that save that I'm doing, trying to do right now, nor will I be getting everything, and I might not even do the little side quests I normally do. So, yeah. Uh, being as that, it might be a little weird when I'm playing it, and knowing how Decimi works, I've never saved this game once, except for at the beginning. And that was when I found out Destiny does not save. At all. And I'm probably saying that thing wrong, so it doesn't matter. Don't correct me. I really don't care. So, with me trying to get it saved from 
an R4 and use that on an emulator like Decimo. I'm, I'm completely cheating. It, like I said, it doesn't matter. Who cares? I don't think the guy who created it even knows the right name. Anyway. So, with it, the emulator not being able to save, and I always have to use save states, I might not be able to use my backup plan and pull someone else's video and then I walk through like I did with Paper Mario. Which I really don't want to do. I'm not kidding, I really don't want to do it. Oh my god. His name is Bone. His evil rain was so deep that it leached the very life force from me. As you know, every creature in this world possesses a sacred power. This power is called life force. No. The sand of ours is a physical manifestation of that power. And that is what brought them here. I struggle against my attacker in a great clash. But his evil was so dark that it slowly drained away my own life force. He was always a step ahead of my attacks, and I eventually overcome. I was dragged to the sunless depths of the tunnel. Sealed up, my life force continues to drain away. There's all those bosses you find. Using the life force he leached from me, his evil separated and bred more and more foul monsters. The spirits of power and wisdom were also imprisoned. But Nama can pronounce managed to spit her out her soul out and escape. The split was why so much of her memory was lost. Even among the monsters born of the Sand of Hours, some are especially evil. The phantoms who roam my temple take after the evil of their master. Supernatural strength, wrapped in plate armor, virtually invincible. They prowl the temple, searching for victims. No one can harm them. Of course, they were created to be untouchable. I had only one option. My ocean of strength had drained just crap. Using my last ounce of strength, I cleaned myself just whatever did. Then I made a humble home mercy. Mercy, I don't know. I used the sand of hours to make the hourglass and enter the temple. I studied my foe, searching for ways to defeat Bellum and waited for my chance. And yeah, sorry, I kind of screwed up. Text went bad, look too fast. Oh well. You guys have the magical power of pausing. No big, no big deal. Yeah, more pointless talking and easily skip by pressing start. But this slow walker kind of got to show it. Oh my god. So many things going through my head. Like, what am I going to do next for my... On YouTube. It's so troublesome. It's gonna be pain in the ass and I don't have much time left because this game will be probably over in maybe ten or so days. to say I should start wrapping this video up, but I can't. Still got about two minutes. All that for a stupid wish. Now another thing I should mention, I'm probably never gonna upgrade this ship in this walkthrough. Mainly because I kind of sell all the parts I normally get. That, and I really don't 
care for most of the ship parts, except for maybe the demon one and a few others. I don't remember all of them by name, but just put some out right in there. So, with you being out of the ghost ship and possibly never being able to return, I'm pretty sure you can't return anyways, never really checked. Yeah, you can't return. I'm gonna start doing some side quests. I think. I'm not sure. I recorded this about a month ago. No, you have to come here. Now I remember. Okay, I was recording the temple. Getting all the treasures and stuff. And thinking, oh, it's okay, I don't have to go through this. But once I got to the door where I had to go to this, like, really, dude? I have to come to this house. So I had to do all those floors over again. I'll talk about that later because I don't want to give spoilers for the next video. And it just freaking pissed me off. So this was after I did the temple and getting a few treasures. Or should I say half the temple anyways. So I kind of fucked myself. Just kind of get. Remember that symbol. Who does they used to try for us in the very first game. Yeah, they did. Yay, video game knowledge beats me again. I know I'm very fun with that. I'll see you guys later. Hope you like my return. Yada yada yada. At least I did it with the boss battle. See you guys later. More come tomorrow. Bye.